Get right. hype, boys. Alright, we have a match. It's Coming Nox up. D versus SS Luck. Didn't sign up with SS. Way to go, Luck! Idiot boy. There we go. Alright. Wonderful. It's like we got Typo over there doing the stream or something. Alright. Into All the right. game. Starting on PS2, pretty standard for Dallas Fort Worth. Yeah. Everyone here likes PS2. It's not like Smashville. Yeah. It's it's a, it's a good stage. All right. So we've got. They're feeling out the neutral. Yeah, pretty much. Luck is very reliant on that banana in neutral. Um, it's such a one, strong tool. Once he gets his opening, Ooh. he combos pretty hard. Yeah. He's known for his insane down air into down air into down air into down air combos. Like Falco. Yeah. Immediately retreats back um, to get an opening for the banana. Yeah. Noxty hovers near it. Kind of like he wants to take it, not sure. Yeah. I don't know what Ooh. he was thinking there, but right now he's winning, so can't complain. Ah, he misses the PK whatever. The PK green thing. Okay, nice upper to take him off the stage. It's really hard to edge guard Ness, though, uh, yeah. if you can't properly cover all of his options. Yeah, I know. If he has to upbeat if he's, from afar. If he's above the stage, he's got almost infinite options, yeah. but below the stage is really hard. Yeah. If he if he has to upbeat from afar, it's pretty Ooh. incredible. Ooh, Luck nice. gets caught by double jump cancel back air. That's very quick. Yeah, Ness acts super quickly. It's hard for you to just call him out and everything. His, his, his attacks will kill you. Mm -hmm. And the double jump looks like it's going one way, and then you yeah, can and quickly then flips turn around. Yeah. yeah. It just kind of messes with how you perceive where Ness is going. If you're too used to fighting normal characters that don't double jump cancel, it can definitely screw you up. Yep. So now he's got Nox D in the corner, grabs the ledge. Oh no, he doesn't uh, grab the ledge. Oh, Nox D, uh, he can usually get those recoveries. I think he was yeah. scared of Lux up B, mm -hmm. which is, to be fair, Lux really good at spiking. Yeah, he didn't want to go straight into him, but he had to have a, that was a really tight angle that he wanted to go for. Yeah. And we saw Luck just now actually uh, just dash dance Nox D away from him, then yeah. retreat and grab the banana. That was actually really nice. Yeah, it was. It was a very good stage control, but then he um, really just goes back to what he knows best, which is throwing bananas. Yep. It's a strong move. It is a very good move. The virtual 30 frames of hit stun of the trip. It's very, very good. It's very, very good. And then All he right. gets pretty free follow-ups after that, and then he can combo very hard. Noxie's movement's actually countering uh, Lux Banana and his uh, movement neutral very well, mm -hmm. although the problem is that he's... His punishes aren't really working out. Yeah, and the way he's kind of you playing neutral, he's giving up a lot of stage place to contest the banana, and then Luck is just cornering him. Yeah, Luck's really strong. Luck knows how to control the stage very well. He's not like he's not like a mid-tier player where they don't know how to control stage all that well. Yeah, no, they'll use the they'll use more of the movement for Ooh, just moving. Does that get him? Get the angle? Nah, he's barely off. Yeah, that's Knocks the SDs to finish the game. So, hmm, I wonder what kind of stage Noxie would want for this matchup. Uh, I'd imagine he wants a smaller stage where Luck can't use the banana so much. Yeah, I agree with that. I would imagine he... I would say something with less platforms, too. Yeah. Um, I feel like FD's actually is, like, strongest. FD's are really good in that stage. Yeah, and Because you FD... can kind of just go. Then you just down B, bit, and you down B, and then, then you grab them. No! Yeah. We're on FD. So he banned Fountain for whatever reason. He probably didn't want to go to it. I don't know. Maybe it's just personal preference. There's a lot of people that just don't like Fountain. Yeah, Fountain's a little bit weird if you aren't super used to it. Yeah, we see Noxie going to, to uh, FD. This Ness is has insane combos in FD. Yeah, so we're going to see if he can pull those off. But he's, this is he's doing them right now. Not a bad um, net, uh, Diddy yeah, Kong's It's also hard to escape Diddy Kong's combos here. That's yeah. the thing. I feel like um, the platforms help Diddy Kong's neutral more. Ness isn't always reliant on him just because of the way he moves around. Whereas Diddy Kong has more room to set up. Ooh, his, catches oh him with God. the down air. Very disrespectful spike attack. The rising down air at a double jump is really, really strong for Ness to cover. Well, since uh, I think Diddy Kong's up, he's negatively disjoined. He can't beat it. No, he can't. Um, you, have, you would have to sweep the spot to get around it. Yeah, it's but if Ness is just hanging there below the ledge with his double jump, like, yeah, what can true. you do? It's also super good for covering um, tag in place. Ah, uh, Noxie goes for the sick uh, down B re-grab, but misses it because he accidentally wave dashed the wrong way. He's been I, really working on his tech skill. It, yeah. it, it incredibly shows. He is. He makes lots of sparkles. Okay. Um, I think Luck might have meant to turn around that grab. Noxty wanted to grab at a shield, but he was holding the banana, so he would have just thrown it instead. He knew that uh, it was unsafe. Good up air. Okay, has him off stage. Up B Luck just waits for it. Oh, yeah. no. 
Okay. At least Ness has a uh, landing grab, a uh, landing lag on his uh, up B. Yeah, that would be very important. He didn't used to it. You just put him in the standing state with a hitbox attached to him, and it was really sad. And he also used to shoot uh, a miniature Falco that's multi shining your shield. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty good. Classic Ness. All right, Lux able to do a finish off Nox D, even up the stocks, but not the percent. We see 71% lead for Nox D. I feel like um, if Luck gets a trip here, okay, yeah, yeah this could be bad. He can get an damage. insane combo. Oh, he, he tries to go for the meteor, misses. <laughs> he went for a meme. Oh, well. So, yeah, see, Luck can just bring back the percentage so fast. This is a very... Oh! Ooh. <laughs> he he, wa he uh, wave landed out of the down B and caught the banana and threw it to finish the combo. That was, that was great. That was super interesting. Okay, dash deck. Oh, can't reach him with the up air. Okay, they're just feeling themselves out in neutral. Luck pulling banana. He knows that Noxie's probably not going to approach from that range. And just throwing out those peanuts, it's hard for Noxie, it's surprisingly hard for Noxie to like approach okay. in the way he wants past those. Because if he goes under them, then Nox, then you know, Lux yeah. slows banana. So good downer up air conversion yeah. from Noxie to finish the Lux stock. Feeling like Falcon. That uh, down B Waveland uh, grab the banana is actually surprisingly good. I didn't expect it, but yeah, it actually it's a really strong option. Mm -hmm. it actually makes a lot of sense now that I think about it. Sweet Ooh. spots. That's how you know an S main. They can sweet spot from above the ledge. Yeah, it's actually pretty difficult. Back air has him off stage. Luck kind of just ah. Oh no. Noxie a little bit scared. Has the up ego a little bit too long and duh, SDs. Okay, he tries to double jump rising down here, but luck doesn't fall for it. Yeah. If you uh, di that down that down throw the wrong way, you should be able to just get a free back air. I'm not sure why Noxie's not going for it. Maybe maybe there's another combo he's trying to do out of it. Yeah, let's him re grab. Maybe he wanted to extend it with an up air or something. Um, maybe a different move would have given him better stage positioning. Yeah. But Noxie's still maintaining the lead. Yes. For this sure. is not a result you usually see because uh, Luck's a very very good player. Yeah, but Luck is one of our top players in DFW. Um, he is he is beating up. Fair number of great players. Oh, trip. Oh, that upper barely catches him. He's super him. far off stage. It's going to be hard for Noxie to recover. Let's him back. All right. Good sweet spot. It's, you don't want to challenge that, it's even at 65, actually. Yeah, That's really Luck hard. just opts to maintain his, the stage control he's built up. Yeah. He Luck's standing in the center of the stage. He knows that Noxie can't really take it. Oh. Oh, the banana barely catches him? Okay, he oh, expected Nox him to roll in. Noxty expected the trip on the banana and rolled to the left trying to tech the trip. Yeah. And uh, got destroyed for it. That's very unfortunate, actually. Good back there. Oh, the banana just disappears. That would have been pretty bad, but this is also pretty bad. Uh, he, he, mi he lost. I don't know. I thought he lost double jump. Oh, <laughs> Luck tries to down air him, gets hit by the up B. Yeah, almost with the And PK we're trading green. PK whatever. Be, okay. Back throw, back throw strong gets him though. Yeah, not the best DI on that, but still a good option to choose from Max D. Max D doing moves, stealing percent. I'm not sure what happened. All I know is that something did. Oh yes, this is true. Oh, oh. the the first hit of the forward smash pushed him off the ledge, uh -huh. so he dropped shield, and then the second hit killed him. Yep, the empty hot forward smash. Now, Reed, I think you have to play a match. I do. I don't know if there's anyone to replace me, though, but I am going to leave. We need uh, we need someone. All right. All right, chat. Good luck. I don't know where you are. I'm not going to look at the chat. See you later. Goodbye, Reed. But uh, I'm alone. Please help. I am lonely. I'll kill you. Sorry, chat. I had to kill someone. I I can't see chat. All I can see is this super cool backdrop. So we're what? Yeah, what is it? What? I'm I am Neptune. Hello, I am Neptune. Actually, Neptune's not here. He's doing something somewhere. JV, he's... Well, Neptune, I think, is playing... I don't know what he's doing, actually. JV is somewhere, too. Who knows? So it's just me now. I'm the only one in the building. 
It's literally everyone is dead. If I turn this camera around, you will literally see nothing. It's just a blank white space. There's not even a room here anymore. We're like, it's like a void. It's literally a void. Yeah. All there is is this, this backdrop. Hey, did you win? You beat Wonder? Excellent. What? He played Fox? Did you give him the downward smash? You gave him the up? So, I was talking to someone. Hello, new best friend. For the time being, my new best friend is here. Hi, hello. Hello. Hi, Cole. How are you doing? I'm okay. How are you? I'm doing all right. I had your PM for like, since... What, months ago? Yeah, you haven't been here in a long time. Okay, cool. So, we're going to have a match soon. We're going to have the legendary Birdman versus the returning G-Rabbit. Awesome. So, we're going to get some Dreamland action. Some, <laughs> some Kirby and DDD. Oh, yeah, I remember this. Oh, yeah. or maybe Falco. Never mind. I'm lying. Well, well uh, Birdman is Falco. Yeah, but who knows what he's going to do. Birdman's a man of mystery. <laughs> yeah. So this could, he could, who knows, maybe he'll play Falcon, which I, I I would tell him that's a terrible idea. I remember, actually, the last time these two played, uh, he did go Falco. Okay, that was months ago, though. Yeah, cause I'm pretty sure he played Falco at that set. has been deployed overseas since January. So it's been a long time since we've seen him. I don't know why he's in Dallas. Who knows? It's a mystery. I know. I don't know. All right, we're gonna get a match though. As we mentioned, it is Burman versus.